Hi guys, so I'm loud, let me calm down. I wanted to share with you how I am doing, how I do 3D backgrounds using an app called Home 3D Design and how you can actually use this app on your mobile tablets as well to create webtoon backgrounds using 3D 3D backgrounds. <laughs> the Home 3D Design is actually an interior designing app. So like if you are an architect or an interior designer, you can use this to create and design different like rooms and in interior design and oh, an exterior design. They have like trees and different different what is it assets that you can add to like spice up the design I'm not good with design I'm not creative with all that my main focus when I'm doing webtoon backgrounds or trying to create webtoon backgrounds is just to get it just created I just if I could just have my character standing in a box with just a simple window boom they're in a room I want you to focus on the story we're not focused on the room other people of course that's their main thing focus is like the design of the room and and all that my main focus right now is just to get a background just to help set the scene set the environment and so we can keep it rolling with the story we got to keep it rolling with the story that's my focus um so that's why i just i don't i don't think too deeply on stuff when it comes to webtoon backgrounds but i do like using home design 3d on my ipad and then you can also use it on the desktop after i come up with a well after i hosh posh <laughs> together a background with Home Design 3D, I it allows you to save it as like a JPEG screen cap and or a JPEG like file, and that will roll through here eventually after I finish messing around. Um, after you save it, I can then import it or upload it onto into Clip Studio Paint, and then of course with Clip Studio Paint, I will do the same thing that I did in my last video. Um, oh, LT conversion. I saw a comment on my last video where someone wanted to see me talk more about it. I can't remember what your name was. I should have wrote it down so I could say hi to you, but hi. <laughs> so with LT conversion in Clip Studio Paint, I don't know the, the specifics, <laughs> but you can trust me. It's okay. I know what I'm talking about. I, well, I kind of know what I'm talking about, but with the LT conversion, I like to use it to ex extract the lines from, from images like this screenshot. I'll... Ooh, 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 backtrack. Also, it has a feature in Home 3D Design to where it it adds like the lines to the 3D background, which is super cool. But anyways, with Clip Studio Paint, the LT conversion can also extract the lines from that, which is lineless, and that, which has the lines. You can't really see it, but you gotta see, no lines, and then the other one had lines. But anyways, LT conversion, it helps to extract the lines from a lineless drawing. So there's that one. And here's the background that actually had the lines already attached. So yeah, I Home Design 3D is a great, it's a great app to use. But anyways, I go ahead and use the LT conversion. I just mess around with it a little bit. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just, I'm legit winging it. Everything that I do is me winging it. Because <laughs> again, my focus, I just want to get a story out. That's, I, I want the story done. And I, I need backgrounds for that. So this is me doing the backgrounds as quickly as possible so I can focus on what I enjoy doing most, which is telling stories. Anyways, I'm, I'm rambling. There I am, I have the lines separated from the background and we are going to go ahead and overlay that onto the colored background that doesn't have the lines. The reason why I separate, why am I talking like that? <laughs> the reason why I separate the lines is because again, I like to use like, it, when you color the lines, it gives it like a nice little pop that doesn't like look as 3D-ish as possible. As, doesn't look too 3D. Anyways, um, should I have, should I stop talking now? I don't know what else to say because it's, it's kind of, you know, you're seeing it. Well, I'll, I'll talk anyways. <laughs> I'm using the color balance because I like to take away some of the 3D kind of color. It's, when you look at 3D models, it has like that 3D color effect. I can't explain it. So I use a color balance to kind of like tone that down. And then I will go in and sometimes I'll go in and color in the lines. Or I'll use layer settings and use the overlay and just drop the opacity of the lines down and it also gives like a nice little effect too. Or I use a gradient and I just like just slap that baby on top from top to bottom and boom. <laughs> I legit, I'm, I'm, I'm such a laid back 
webtoon artist i just want to get the backgrounds done so i can get the story told i just because i have so many stories i want to do and i don't i personally don't want to spend a bunch of time making backgrounds so this is how you guys can do it too <laughs> if you don't like spending a lot of time making backgrounds if you don't know how to make backgrounds um you, try this out and you still want to draw a story you can still draw a story even if you don't know how to do your backgrounds don't let that stop you you can create your story if people are telling you oh you're cheating well did are you i don't i don't know what to say to that i'm just just create your story <laughs> create your story don't steal other people's stuff of course you know make sure you got the proper license and whatnot which you know luckily with home design you don't have to worry about that just like with clip studio paint stuff too i'm rambling anyways don't let this stop you from creating your webtoon. Even if you can't draw like me, you can still create that webtoon and get that story out and 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 achieve your dreams. <laughs> oh, okay. I I better go cuz now I'm running out of time. I hope this helped and I, I hope you guys found it useful. Make sure to let me know if you have any other questions or I'll just come back with another Vlogmas Webtoon Artist Rambles video. Okay, thank you so much for watching guys. Bye.